What is going on everyone? Welcome back to the channel. Oh, hi to Yara for Denmark. We are very thankful for our viewers around the world. In today's video, we will take a look at the Flybird adjustable dumbbells, which was sent to us from Flybird, so thank you for that. Like always, we will do an unbiased review with pros and cons, so let's get started. All right, we got them out of the box. We're good to go. Let's test them out. First impression here of the Flybird adjustable dumbbells, 25 pounds they go up to. $110 each, so you need two of them, right? They also have a pair that goes up to 55, and they are $100 extra a piece. But overall, first impression looks very nice. Metal handle here, uh, metal plates, and then the rest is plastic. But let's, uh, let's just test them out right away. Let's see what's going on here. Let's go to five. And that's your five right there. Not bad. Cool. So they're definitely easy to re-rack. So sometimes oh, some oh, of these... Oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> we'll edit that out. Of course we won't. Okay, so as we're changing the weight here, when I do remove it from, uh, from, the, from the base here, the heaviest weight, the base does not go with the dumbbell. A lot of the adjustable dumbbells have that, uh, but these ones do not, so that's always nice. When you do rack them, you wanna be uh, sure that you got this little indent here that's gonna be pushed down by that little fellow there. So you wanna make sure that they are in right or else you're not gonna be able to change your weight, okay? So you do have to be a little bit careful just make sure they are um, racked in, but that is basically their security system. So right now I cannot I cannot rotate the handle here, okay? But overall, nice grip on them. And if we go to 25 here, again, the base stays. Let's go down here on the floor. One thing that will separate the flybirds here is the handles from, let's say, other adjustable dumbbells. That's the metal handle, which is always nice, right? The less plastic we can have on a dumbbell, kind of the less will break easily. If you're looking for a dumbbell that's going to last a little bit longer, then you definitely want to look into the Flybirds. If you're debating Flybirds or Core Home or uh, Bowflex or something like that, then I feel like the durability here uh, might be a little bit more than the other two options. We've tried a lot of different adjustable dumbbells and we got more videos out there. so. We definitely have some experience. And one of the things that I dislike about adjustable dumbbells is the plates moving a lot, especially the bow flex, also the core home fitness, they move a lot. So let's test uh, the flybirds here. I can move them a little bit and each plate will move a little bit. They're definitely not as loose as the bow flex or the core home, which had a lot of loose plates, especially the smaller ones. So not bad overall um, with the flybirds. Okay guys, so now it's time for a placement test. We have ours on our rogue rack here and we are going to test to see how easy or hard it is to get them on and off. Let's just start with 15s. So it was definitely pretty easy to take off and didn't have a problem with it coming up. Okay, so for somebody who has always struggled with putting adjustable dumbbells back in their spot, Let's see how I do. <laughs> well, I did bad. it, guys. <laughs> All right, good job. Thank you. So we have on this rack, as you guys can see, it's kind of tilted down. So even uh, with it slightly angled, uh, quite easy to get dumbbells in and out. So no, no, no problem there at all, that's always nice. And also, if you don't have, if you don't have like, let's say a dumbbell rack, you just wanna put them down on a box or a wooden bench or a bench in general and you wanna secure them, you can always do that with a strap around, but you don't really need to as long as you are, you know, you're not throwing them down there or anything. So overall, not bad at all. As with all our videos, <laughs> time for pros and cons. So what do we really like about the Flybirds? We like the, uh, the handle is metal, the plates are metal, and we also like that uh, the base 
and the dumbbell itself, easy to move around and easy to grab the weights even when it's on a angled dumbbell rack. So very nice. Also the price, you know, these two combined, 220, not bad these days for basically five sets of dumbbells, right? So that's what we really like. And if I had to say a couple of things I would like to see improved on, let's say their next version, it will definitely be the uh, knurling here on the handle, which is quite weak. I like personally a little more aggressive knurling, but you may not. So, uh, but just my own personal opinion here. All right, partner, what do you think? Okay, so for me, I like the fact that it's really not much bigger than a normal 20 pound dumbbell. So it's not like bulky, like some of the other brands. And I also like the fact that um, it feels like a normal dumbbell, like with this handle right here, whereas some of the other ones are plastic or maybe just not as good, so. Cool, thank you. You're welcome. All right, everyone, that is the end of this video. If you have any questions, just let us know in the comments and we'll get back to you as soon as possible. And also help us out by subbing so we can continue making videos and we'll see you all next time. Atiyada Sumefa Denmark, we see you next video. Arigato.